I'm in a few days from moving into the van now and you know you just forget about all the red tape and these processes of being an actual adult. I need to go back to the DMV today. No! I can't remember one time that I've gone into the DMV and things have gone my way. Like everything's gone smoothly and I've gotten done what I need to do. It's always, oh, no, you're missing this paper or you forgot that paper or we don't serve immigrants here. I swear that was what they said today. They're only serving uh, American citizens. But it's all a process. Just getting used to stuff. I think that's the hard part of this journey is just streamlining everything. Looking at the totality of my possessions and trying to edit that down. I don't want to put things in storage. I don't want to be paying every month for storage. Um, but there are also things I just can't, um, I can't give away. Look at her. She doesn't want anything to do with me right now. <laughs> She's so mad. So she is so happy right now i don't know if you can hear her but this makes me so happy i have one more one more haircut before i leave orlando i love this girl crystal she's the best she knows my hair so well i mean look at it it's just i haven't had it cut in who knows how long and it's still perfect uh, <laughs> i'm not trying to get sound conceited i'm trying to put over crystal Still running around now i'm trying to sell my car all right well it's moving day i was determined not to do this with any movers i have some things i needed to put in storage um some of my dad's artwork uh antique teacups uh some sentimental gifts you know just i did my best i sold most of my belongings and furniture but there are just some sentimental things that I need to put in the storage, so only storing the essentials. Yeah, man, there are some annoying things you have to do when you make big changes. Um, frustrating things. It's like, I know they need to be done, but they seem impossible, and they mess up my timeline. Mmm! <laughs> It's day two of my move. Man, it, yeah, it's just been raining, as if you can't tell. I got a little haircut, too. It's actually not that hard moving. I could actually be a professional mover. I'm strong. I don't mind that kind of work at all. <laughs> I'm proud of myself, honestly. So pretty much everything that I need to put in storage is in storage, and let me tell you, I am a badass woman. I made it all fit. Cookie knows something's up, you know. She's so mad. Like, she's so mad. She's attacking me. She's hissing. And like growling and stuff. And I'm um, it's not with crying over, you know, but it is just like really upsetting because I don't know what to do to make her feel better. She's really pissed. <laughs> She's like pissed, pissed, you know, and like, like, Oh, my elbow. Did you hear that? Well, this is my last night in my apartment. And here I am sleeping on the floor because <laughs> I sold my bed and then I sold my futon. And it reminds me of Japan a little bit. And I'm hoping that Cookie cooperates tonight. Hopefully she just comes and sits here where she always does. Oh, look who decided to join me. Today's the day. That's the thing about moving is it never ends. There's always something more to do. Well, I'm like halfway through cleaning the place, which is good. Uh, had a little misstep with the car. Um, couldn't end up selling it. Had to take it in for a repair, so I add that to the list of things to do today. But just generally excited, because it's almost time.
Uh, she just got sprayed trying to fill up the water. Hilarious. It's official, I made it. I live in a van. You know, you find out who your friends are when it's time to move. That's for sure. Like, there's no way I could have even finished in time if it hadn't been for them. Aww. Oh, I'm just so relieved that it's over and the adventure begins.